Tunisia votes today in the country's second free election since its former president was ousted in the onset of the Arab Spring. The election highlights a familiar rivalry between the country's secular and Islamist communities. Tunisia's secularists have previously lacked unity and organization, but today they're favored over their moderate Islamic rivals. We've been waiting for this day like it's a wedding, said this man. It's the second time and we all have to take part in the election, so good things can happen to Tunisia. Sure, we are happy, said this woman. This time it's a democratic election. We hope it will be better than the last time. It's well organized and everything is clear. Hardline militants have threatened to disrupt the voting. Security forces have been cracking down on suspected extremists in the run-up to the election. On Friday, security forces killed six people, including five women, after a standoff with hardline Islamists on the outskirts of Tunis.